गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी शिल स्टार्ट एक्सरसाइज थर्टीन पॉइंट वन एंड वी विल बी डूइंग अप टू क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर टूडे ओके इन द नेक्स्ट क्लास विल डू फ्रॉम क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव टू क्वेश्चन नंबर इलेवन ओके सो टूडे लुक एट क्वेश्चन नंबर वन फाइंड द पैरामीटर ऑफ द फॉलोइंग फिगर्स सी ह्यूर टू फाइंड दिस the parameter of these figures what you need to do you need to draw these figures in a notebook okay see how i have done you have to do in the same manner see see here we will be finding the parameter of this figure with length 10 cm 8 cm 6 cm and 8 cm okay so here formula is not applicable so you will be writing parameter equals to sum of all sides okay to so sum of all side you will writing 10 cm plus 8 cm plus 8 cm plus 6 cm okay now add all 10 plus 8 is 18 18 plus 8 is 26 26 plus 6 is 32 so here we have got the perimeter of this figure as 32 cm clear like this you can do question number b c and d by yourself it's a very simple question so you can easily do these questions by yourself so you can try these question work b c d now look at question number 2 find the perimeter of the rectangles whose length and breadth are given see here in question number 2 we will be using the formula we will be using the formula okay length for length i'll write l length is 20 cm and breadth is 15 cm okay here we will use formula of perimeter of rectangle perimeter of rectangle equals to 2 into length plus breadth okay 2 into length plus breadth okay so write 2 here in bracket length is 20 plus breadth is 15 okay now add 20 and 15 so write 2 into 20 plus 15 is 35 right 35 okay 2 into 35 you can multiply and write then so 2 into 35 is 70 cm like this you have to find out perimeter of rectangle okay we'll do one more question question number c question number c okay length and breadth is given okay length is 48.3 48.3 cm and breadth is 29.6 cm okay it's a simple question use the same formula perimeter of rectangle equals to 2 into 
length plus breadth okay now right 2 into what is length 48.3 right 48.3 plus 29.6 29.6 okay now right 2 into 48.3 and 29.6 you need to add and then write okay 6 plus 3 is 9 decimal 8 plus 8 16 117 4 plus 2 6 1 7 so we have got 2 into 77.9 okay so 2 into 77.9 you need to multiply 77.9 into 2 just multiply and get the answer okay so after multiplying 2 into 77.9 we are getting 155.8 centimeter so just multiply in this manner and get the answer you know after solving each and every question you can verify your answer from the back of the book okay so other two question other question like question number b you can do by yourself okay now question number three find the perimeter of squares whose sides are side is given 28 centimeter so use the formula perimeter of square equals to 4 into side perimeter of square equals to 4 into side 4 into what is the side 28 centimeter right 28 centimeter okay 4 into 28 you just multiply and write the answer 4 it's a 32 3 4 2 0 8 9 10 11 112 centimeter okay let's do one more question question number c 42 meter Forty two meter. Use the same formula. Okay. Perimeter of square equals to four into side. Right four into what is the side given here? Forty two. Right forty two. Okay. Now you multiply. 4 to the 8, 4 for the 16. 168 meter. Like this, you can solve each and every question from question number 3. Okay. So here, I am giving you question number B and D as homework. You just multiply and get the answer. Okay. B and D. Okay. Now, let's move to question number 4. Find the side of the squares whose perimeters are. You need to find the side. In this question, we need to find the side as the perimeter is already given. Okay. So, let's remind. I just explained you in the basics for the formula of finding side. Okay. So, question number 4. A. 812 centimeter 812 centimeter solution side of square equals to perimeter divided by 4 perimeter divided by 4 okay what is the perimeter given here? 812 centimeter, right? 8, 1, 2 divided by 4. You know, we can cut it. We can cut it. 2, 2, 0, 4. 2, 4, 0, 8. 0, 0, 0. 2, 6, 0, 12. Okay. 2, 1, 0, 2. 2, 2, 0, 4. 0, 0, 3, 0. Okay. So, what is the answer we are getting here? 203 centimeter. Okay. Like this you can 
cut and find out the answer if you don't know how to cut you can divide simply and write the answer okay so it's a very simple division okay now let's do one more question let's do question number d 48.4 kilometer d 48.4 kilometer okay solution same formula you are going to use side of square equals to perimeter by 4 okay now what is the perimeter given here 48.4 48.4 divided by 4 clear now cut it 4 1 the 4 4 1 the 4 4 2 the 8 decimal will be there 4 1 the 4 so the answer will be 12.1 kilometer okay 12.1 kilometer like this you can find out the other two questions by yourself so homework is question number b and c okay so today we are doing up to question number four and in the next class we'll do from question number five onwards okay so today you complete up to question number four if you have any doubt we will be discussing that in the online class okay